Hi, in this video we're going to talk about Yahoo Answers as part of the social networking video series. So in this video we're going to talk about how you can use Yahoo's Yahoo Answers social networking site to drive traffic to your website, to your blog, or to use it to build your credibility, or to use it to even also build relationships with people who are interested in the same niche or in the same specific market that you are in. So let's go ahead and get started. Now if you have not used Yahoo Answers before, what Yahoo Answers is, it's a social networking site that allows people to ask questions and allows people to answer them. The people that are answering the questions are most likely considered experts or you know if your question gets chosen as the expert question then a lot of people look at that especially in the future so it's a great way to answer questions at the same time search engines will most likely index them and so if somebody's searching for that same answer they have that same question and your question is chosen then in fact that's a great way to drive traffic to your site so now you sort of get an idea of what Yahoo Answers is Let's go ahead and go to the site so that you can see it in action. So I'm at Google right now and I want to go to Yahoo Answers. So I'll just type it in here so that you can see where to go. So it's at answers.yahoo.com. So this is what Yahoo Answers looks like. You can ask a question here. You can answer a question or you can also discover questions that have already perhaps been answered. So right now I have an account at Yahoo Answers. I have about 500 points and points all that matters is how many questions you've viewed and how many questions you've answered. And as you can see you have different levels. And what you want to do is you want to make sure that you find answers that usually perhaps address an urgent problem. Now when you focus on answering urgent questions because people need the answer right now. If you do that your conversion rates go back straight up because people are looking for an answer right away. They need it right away. You know so they're willing to either pay or if you help them out using a, this as a pre-sale method uh, which is great you also build a relationship and when they see that you know you're not there just to make the money you're not there just to do a hard sell you're really there to answer the questions then they see that then they're more likely to either buy your product sign up on your list or even sign up for a free item that you might be providing on your website so here are the categories you have arts and humanities beauty and style business cars Computers, food, education, entertainment, environment, food and drink, and much, much more. So your goal here is you can ignore these questions here, but focus on the categories which fit your niche. So let's say, for example, that you are selling a dating product. So you would probably go to the family and relationships category as shown here. Once you do that a lot of these people are asking questions some of them are just random uh, but some of them are urgent and let's say that your product really helps them to solve a specific problem or another good place to go is business section so if we go to the business and finance section you'll notice that there are questions that you can answer which are open questions, uh, discover questions that have already been answered, which are resolved questions, and you don't need to go there really because uh, your goal is to answer questions. So with that in mind, you can find something like how to start a successful website. This person wants to know how to start a successful website. Now, but just to show you, you know, what it's all about, you can just simply click on answer this question, fill in your answer, and press submit. Uh, once you do that, these people who are asking the questions 
what they do is they can choose your answer to being the best answer. So let's say 10 people answer the question and yours is the best. Now if yours is the best, then you end up getting on the top. Let me go to a resolve question and show you what it looks like. Every resolve question has a best answer. As you can see here, this person's asking the question, does a bank job require good credit? Best answer chosen was this. So your goal is to get the best answer because if it's the best answer, people who are searching on the same question will find your answer and if you have a source information and that source links to your website, then you have more and more people coming to your website. So that's a great feature as you can see right there. Aside of that, the good thing about Yahoo Answers is it allows you to also do social networking in the sense if you highlight somebody's name, you can see how many answers they got right, you know, 21 best answers. You can add them to your contacts, you can block the user if you want. Uh, but when you add your contacts, you can also build a network of people who are basically in the same area as you. So once you build a network of people who perhaps are interested in your area or, you know, things like that, then what happens here is that you start building relationships with people in your niche. So specifically like MySpace, Facebook, how I mentioned about you adding friends that are interested in that same area. Well, it's the same concept here as well. But with Yahoo Answers, you get a lot of people who are asking questions that have problems and you're basically providing answers to those questions so what you're doing here is Yahoo Answers allows you and gives you the opportunity to basically show your expertise on a certain matter so with that said when you answer people's questions just remember that when you do that make sure that you answer it with a answer that is legitimate, has value, has some sort of content base in it. Because if you don't, it'll be listed as spam and what good does that do? So you're using something here that is a white hat type tactic. You're not using those black hat tactics where you spam, you know, blogs here and there, here and there. You're being rewarded for answering it correctly, answering it with good content, and much more. So that's a great thing to keep in mind. So when you use Yahoo Answers, make sure you do it right so that you can get a lot of traffic in the long run. Now, instead of posting, let's say you get 50 questions and you post 50 answers, but instead of focusing on perhaps 50 of those, you could focus on 25 of those and most of these people, I can tell you right off the bat that most of the answers that they get will most likely be just bogus questions, things that are from their head. And you can see who really had put thought into it. And from my experience, generally if you put an answer that really has content and really shows that you put a lot of thought into that answer, then I'd say six out of ten times your answer is chosen or even more than that seven times so with that said go ahead and use Yahoo answers to start driving traffic to your website